one in five teens did not secure their first choice school due to population boom. Nearly one in five teens didn't get their first choice of secondary school this year, as a population boom triggers a chronic school places shortage. Official Department for Education figures revealed just 82.1% got their first pick of high school, compared with 83.5% in 2017. It is the fifth year in a row the proportion of children missing out on a place at their top choice of secondary school has risen. Overall the numbers getting an offer on any of their school preferences also dropped. Pupil numbers in secondaries are expected to rise by 600,000 to 3.3 meters by 2025 before stabilizing, thanks to a population surge fueled by immigration which has already passed through primary schools. Almost 18% missed out on a high school place compared with 16.5% last year. It means the percentage of those getting their first choice secondary school dropped to below 83.2% for the first time since 2010-11. The proportion of applicants who received an offer of any of their preferred schools also dropped slightly from 96.1% last year to 95.5% this year. The Department for Education which released the figures, said the rise in 11-year-olds missing out on their top-choice secondary school coincided with a spike in applications, up 3.6% on the previous year and the highest by number since data collection started in 2008. Schools Minister Nick Gibbs said more than 9 out of 10 pupils were offered their first choice of primary school, an increase on last year. Richard Watts, chairman of the local government association's Children and Young People Board, said, these figures show demand is reducing in primary schools but increasing in secondary schools. With nearly 70% of secondary schools now academies or free schools, the lack of any council power or influence over the expansion and admissions policies of academies and free schools is a real concern.